Hey everyone, it's Mark for Windows Central and here's a look at the pen and ink settings on Windows 10 Anniversary Update. So we'll just go to all settings, devices, and there's an option here that says pen and Windows ink. Let's go ahead and select that. Here are the options. Uh, so let's take a look at some of them. There's a show cursor and uh, what happens here is that when you hover your pen on top of the display, uh, there might be this cursor showing on display uh, that might be distracting to some people. So you can go ahead and turn that off. And next time you hover on top of the display, uh, the cursor is gone. So another option is ignore touch input when you're using your pen. Right now it's off. Uh, so what happens is that while uh, the pen is near the display and I tap the Windows key, uh, it's still going to work with my finger. However, if I turn that on and say my pen is just near the display and I tap the Windows key, see it's ignoring it right now, but if I lift up the, the pen and tap the Windows key, it, it works. So it's up to you if you wanna turn that on or off, that's to ignore the touch input when you're using your pen. And another setting that's cool is that to show the handwriting panel when you're not in tablet mode and there's no keyboard attached. So here I'm gonna use the pen and tap on Cortana and you can see the handwriting uh, panel shows up instead. So you could write like that. Or if I use my finger with Cortana, it's going to open up the keyboard instead of the handwriting panel. And if you scroll down, you'll see the Windows Ink Workspace Pen Shortcuts. This is where you could assign shortcuts to your pen. So for example, I've set it up so that if I click once, uh, you'll see the Windows Ink Workspace Home. But you could change that to something else. You could launch OneNote or any other app. Uh, you could also launch directly into an app within Windows Ink. So for example, I want it to open Sticky Notes. So I'm gonna go ahead and click once and uh, Sticky Notes should show up in just a few seconds. And there's an option for double click. So for example, I've used Sketchpad for that shortcut. I'm gonna go ahead and double click and that should open up Sketchpad. And here's another option you might want to look at. It's a uh, click once to open Windows Ink Workspace even when the device is locked. It's off right now. I'm going to go ahead and turn that on. Then I'm going to lock the device. So here's the login screen. I'm going to go ahead and click my pen and that should open up my sticky notes. All right, so that's a look at the pen and Windows Ink settings on Windows 10. For more Windows 10 tips and how to, head over to windowscentral.com.